गुड मॉर्निंग एवरी वन आई एम आर्या एंड आई विल बी डीलिंग टूडे केस लॉ दैट इज के एम नाना वडी वर्स स्टेट ऑफ महाराष्ट्र दिस केस ऑफ के एम नाना वडी वर्स स्टेट ऑफ महाराष्ट्र इज वन ऑफ द लैंडमार्क जजमेंट इन द हिस्ट्री ऑफ इंडियन जुडिशरी दिस केस रिसीव अनप्रेसिडेंटेड मीडिया कवरेज इट इज ऑल्सो नोन एज द लास्ट केस टू बी हर्ड एज एज अ ज्यूरी ट्रायल इन इंडिया since the government abolished the jury system as a result of this case this case highlights an important concept of free and sudden provocation uh what are the issues in this case before the court uh one whether the high court lacked jurisdiction under section 307 of crpc to examine the facts in order to determine the competency of the sessions judge whether the high court had the power to strike aside the jury decision on grounds of mis uh, dis- misdirection in charge of 307 clause 3 of crpc whether there were any misdirection in the charge whether the jury's decision was such that it might have been reached by a group of reasonable men based on the facts presented to them whether the pardoning power of the gov- governor and the special leave petition can be clubbed together so as a result of this case the km uh, i uh, reached at a conclusion that the, this case of uh, km nana was a state of maharashtra it was one of the most contentious matters deal with the indian deal with by the indian judiciary from a jury verdict of not guilty to being found guilty of murder by the supreme court the case received extraordinary media coverage which most likely had the uh, significant impact on the jury's de- uh, decision uh, punishment should not be assumed or presume uh, presumptively imposed a crime's penalty should be proportionate to the crime committed penal rules are strictly interpreted and the nanavati case demonstrate the strict interpretation of penal statutes so this is from my side if you like this video like share and comment thank you